it's like to me, hip hop's not a man's world. We think it is, but everything we do is for women. Need more women in rap. I don't want to look at dudes all day. I like the new ones now. I think they're up to par. Nicki Minaj and Cardi B. You know, the struggle that comes with being a woman and the survival of it all is like, it's like kind of gangster. You can't have hip hop without women because then why would men be trying to make money or talking about making money or getting dressed? So there is no hip hop without women. The perspective of a woman is necessary and the stronger they get, the stronger they're gonna speak on it and they're selling more records. That's that. Hey. Big old freak, huh? Big booty, big old tree. Huh? I'ma make him wait for the puss. Wait, wait, hit us in the big old ski. Hey, feet on the I love it. I love when someone owns who they are and they're honest. Suck it, then look in his eyes. Then the next day I might leave him on red. Hey. Some girls be freaks and act like they not. She's like, nah, I'm a poor big old freak. Big, big old freak. That's what I'm saying. Girls are now, they're like, I'm gonna be the dudes now, cause they really are. I don't think girls should give a fuck what a man thinks. Men are dumb. Art is not giving a fuck. And if I'm her, my agenda is to get criticism. My agenda is to be disruptive. What's wrong with being a big old freak? Coming out hard like 88, make a bitch levitate, baby face, such bitch, I don't play patty cake, charms in the carrot cake, carrots in the patty face, cop a new coupe, no top, this is Kelly Way. Drop a little check, everybody lit. She's too young for me to be looking at like that. Next. See, the thing is, if she's that young talking about adult things, she better not be talking about having no sex, using no drugs, or none of that, or else that's pedophile ear. I don't know what the girl's talking about, but I don't even want to hear it. But if she's talking about fucking, or she's talking about anything an underage girl's not supposed to be doing, then that's just promoting to me the Me Too moment that we don't want. They said, Rico, you so nasty. I said, thank you very much. Yeah. He just want to eat me like some candy, but I'm not his buttercup. <laughs> These hoes swear that they can't see Did Lyft pay for this? They definitely did. That's smart. I just made a 100K in two weeks, little bitch. Do you need me to pull it up? <laughs> she's swaggy. I like her a lot. This shit is hard right here. I want to hear this shit. She's the winner. I like that she has a crew, you know, a swaggy girl with a bunch of swaggy girlfriends. I want to see that. I like the type of girls that laugh at niggas too. If you're not cool enough, so they look like they're that. Catch myself sitting by the phone, waiting for you to just hit my line. Dang. What I do like is like she's being sexy without showing anything, and it looks like that's strategic. Tell you how I feel, baby. I don't want to look dumb, so I'm cool with just being friends with you, even if I know you're the one. Because this is looking like Janet Jackson. This is like some girl LL shit. Back in the day, I need love. It's cool. I don't, when, I, when I do listen to rap, I don't be wanting to be like a love. So. I like uh, when he used to do Rock the Bells, boys, but I need love. If you can do and make money off being a YouTube by doing music, that's great. When you have a personality, you just have to have things to sell. So music is one of them. Clothes is one of them. Her tour is one of them. There's nothing better than sitting by the pool and getting a check for doing nothing. You have to invest heavy when you're young and be reckless and do all that dumb shit and make sure you own it so that you can reap the benefits of it later in a very adult way. You have to evolve your hustle. I'm trying to hold on, but I can't get a hold of you. What is he waiting for? My daughter's listening to this. I really like the way she looks, and I like the record. So are you with me? Oh, it's nothing. Fella, me a fun in here. When I'm waiting on the test. It's her and other tour draw, but she wins because she's from Harlem. I'm from Harlem, so I got to support Harlem. You know, in Harlem, it's not about being a tough guy. It's just about being thorough very cocky. The women in Harlem, they're so gangster. They roll dice, they look good, they don't get old, they take care of the block, they be having establishments and look good. No, she's pretty as fuck. Talk, talk to me. She a uh, homeboy's girl? Oh, that shit, I know why she's friend. <laughs> That was my girl, I have what happened to. That's his girl, I can't speak on that man girl. See, that's the thing, like when you put your girl out there, that means you're gonna want men to want her. And I don't know, that, that's, I, I, have, I have respect for people and men as a man, so if that's that man girl, I can't really think about it. I don't, I don't even look at my homeboys girls in their face, not even in the eyes. I thought there was a pocket for all of them. I think, I actually thought all of them were necessary. Like there's a YouTuber, there's a real rapper, there's somebody's girl. I mean, I see how you broke it down, it was intelligent. Really, I don't listen to what they saying. I just wanna hear, I just wanna dance. They all had visuals. I'm a director, so I know the lights. I know what, I can look at the lenses and shit. Like I'm looking at it technically. It's hard for me to look at shit and not break it down because I'm a boss. So I don't just enjoy shit, I figure shit out. After watching all these videos, the ones that I think, it was a draw. My cosign goes to the one from Harlem, Melly, and Rico Nasty. I like Rico Nasty. They were both swaggy. I like the records. And the girl said boss, she from Harlem, so I fuck with that. Yeah, so Billy Pablo the third, you know, boss talk, me. The boss says, 
This is a draw. They're both good. What I like to see is whose show is better. That's what the network's gonna be. Showcasing logic and accountability. And I made all of the content. So the difference is a real gangster has a fucking streaming service instead of all these punk streaming services that aren't run by real bosses. And then it'll be a bunch of like, I'm so sick of Netflix. Every time I call them, they, they got some nerd trying to humble me. I'm like, fuck y'all. I'll do it myself. Fuck Netflix.